My family was not um, religious or believers. And after I got saved, um, my pastor at the time, he wanted to speak to my parents. And I was living at home at the time. I was a, a young adult. And he would make arrangements to come over to visit and have tea with my folks. And he would, we would speak of the things of the Lord and he would testify of God's goodness. And my father was a hard, hard man. He was an abusive man, he was an alcoholic. But something, something, it was the spirit of the Lord, got a hold of him. And just by a seed and then by continued feeding of the word, it grew and grew and grew. And when the pastor would go home, my father would want to talk about the things that were said and about the word of God. And it was just by little increments, because when he'd, he'd heard enough, of conviction, I guess, um, he would say, that's it, I don't want to hear anymore. But, but, he didn't let it go because God did not let go of him. And he wound up giving his heart to the Lord and he softened and it was a wonderful thing to see. And the witness of it on the rest of my family, my mother, and brother and sister was um, just amazing. Yes, and both parents have gone home to be with the Lord now, and my brother also has gone home to be with the Lord, and I'm just overwhelmed that, you know, that's not the end. That's the beginning of their journey, and for me one day too, and my sister, and so many others who, who will just take a little step of faith and ask the question, God, are you real? Because God sees the heart. If the heart really wants to know, God will get the message through in a way that you can understand and you can know. And just by little increments, the growth will come. And it's, it's so, so worth it. It's so, so worth it.